On a 50-acre cocoa farm owned by 2013, uh, uh, national best farmer, Abraham Eduse, is alleged to have been given to a small-scale mining firm in the eastern region. And in studio, we have Nano Boadia Boating, who is president for the Concerned Farmers Association of Ghana. And uh, Isaac Eduse is the son of Abraham Eduse, who uh, was the 2013 national best farmer. And they are here to throw more light on the situation. I'll start with you, Nano Boadia. Um, how often does something like this happen in the Eastern region? Well, it's like, uh, thank you very much and good morning to your viewers. It's rampant. It's mm. something that is, go is ongoing. As I'm speaking to you, we have young men. They said they've, they've placed a ban on Galamsey. But then when you go to uh, Chibia Pepem, as I'm speaking to you right now this morning, uh, it's going it's on. It's ongoing. It's ongoing mm. that they are doing it. So it's like... Uh, what others are seeing it on radio or TV about Galamse is not true. It's real. Something is happening. They get it. Uh, Eastern region, a place like Esikesu, I have, uh, this is a, a court injunction from the high court, mm. you know, mm. which they place an injunction order on this kind of a cocoa plantation. But right. then, yes, still, they went ahead to destroy it. Almost 4,000 acres of cocoa plantation were destroyed just to plant rubber. And the same thing is happening at Chebia Pepem, which uh, the, the, the presidency, this is not uh, Ghana government, this is the presidency has given a whole concession to uh, uh, small scale miners to come and mine, which is, uh, I, I don't know how to put it, but it doesn't make sense. Tell us about the 50 you know, acre uh, cocoa farm that has been destroyed. What, what exactly happened? Yeah, the 50 acre is yet to destroy it. Mm. You know, they've not touched it, they've touched some portion of the, of the land. And then this farm is a global award-winning cocoa farm in the world. Right. Which is no place like the president's hometown, that is Chebi, which this farm is. We are thinking of making the farm as a tourist center that people will travel all over the world to come and have a look at it. But now the, the presidency has given it for a concession mm. just to destroy it. And no other person like a whole, our own father, Ibrahim, as we say, who is the global president of cocoa farmers in the world, his farm. So we, the concerned farmers, heard this thing and we just rushed the place, take videos and other things about it. Because at the end of the day, we are moving through the farming, cocoa farming community, mm -hmm. advocating for farmers not to destroy their cocoa or to cut mm -hmm. their cocoa trees down. We are protecting the cocoa trees. And the presidency is rather destroying the cocoa in this country. Mm -hmm. So what the president said that uh, the one million tons that is our target that we are going to get, it's a totally lies, full of lies mm. and political gig. Because we believe that he went to Cote d'Ivoire to talk to them about partnership on how we can sell our cocoa and other things. There's no way that Cote d'Ivoire will destroy their cocoa in, uh, in place of how they call it, uh, with Galamsi or maybe with mine. For so many years that Ghana has been mining this, uh, uh, how do you call it, uh, uh, gold and then diamond what has we achieved nothing L let me come to isaac isaac you say um your father has worked a lot and that won him the 2013 national best farmer but um, it turns out that his farm might be destroyed uh, just so mining can go on on that land how does that make you feel i'm sorry yeah cocoon yeah and on Kwane, my friend said, A Juma, why it? Why you, my baby? Nemo, bra, a better horse, on per se, on be your bit to cocoon, a day, a two gold, no. A yenigi, a copium say. Open your brand, my do say, never pankasa, a woman, and on. Now cocoon also. A yen a bush young quan or the show. What the shinny puppy bree a woman. And to be to us on person to cocoon, a son, no, a man and be a fee. Son is a cocoa de anona, a cutta, gana, yamai, or quambiso. Inti a bra, a son never torn, is here, I mean, okay, say. What they are any pa doctors, a chartered accountants. Mm. And the baby, she see I'm no case. Crow, you probably say twenty. I will be very invested, sir. I will gain her worship. So I go go crow. I know the Ibu Sabran. And the other two, I say, I'm pursuing to go cool. And the Jennifer, 
Inte e hena ne de sa land no e ma e galam se fono se omo fanye e ejuma no. Se se de e me kan se aban. E ne de ma galam se fono san se om sign board o mo si no. O se office of the president. Inte me kan se aban e ne de e ma o abitu. E san se omo tu e ri ho nyina ma na ko kasa 50 50 kalan e yi no omo tu benkum omo tu nifa omo tu nenim enti na wo benya kwa 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 funu mu wonti menko enti ye san ko fa eh buduza e san be ye kwan no an sana yetimi akọ afu ni so Isaac is saying that he's just generally not happy. He's disappointed that after his father has put in this much work, uh, the land is going to be taken away, uh, you know, to be used for small-scale mining. He's saying that that same uh, land was used to take care of chartered accountants. It was used to produce uh, some doctors by his father. So he's not happy that the government is in agreement with the land being taken from his dad to be used for small-scale mining. Nano Boade, um, let me ask this. What kind of agreement? has gone on between government and then uh, the owner of the farmland? There's nothing like any agreement. There's no agreement. They've not came to their place or come to their place to compensate them or give them money or any other thing. Mm. And then they don't even need a compensation. What we want the presidency to understand is Coco is Ghana and Ghana is Coco. Mm. We don't want any galamse or maybe any mining, you know, mm. because when you go to Cote d'Ivoire, they are the pro cocoa producing in the world. At first, we are the first. But, but what makes come. you what makes you think this decision is from the president to you? Because you keep mentioning him. Um, I keep mentioning him because we are the people of the country. They have to listen to us. But who has come to you with this? Who has said that government is the one that is initiating? It's government that is initiating. The assigned board is there. Billboard, the presidency, Republic of Ghana, giving a concession mm. to, how do you call it, uh, this uh, colleague, I mean, I say, uh, uh, small-scale miners. Mm -hmm. You know, so we, I, if... I don't think there some, uh, anybody at all can just wake up in the morning and go and place a sign board, the presidency with the, with the crown of the Republic of Ghana, the coat of arms. I don't think it would be like that. Mm. And no place like the president's hometown, Chebi, which uh, the whole country, the Cocoa Roads, they, they place a ban on it. That is the only place that they constructed the road. You know, and that is where the cocoa too is, and they are destroying it. So the Concerned uh, Farmers Association is obviously not happy with it, but uh, what have you done um, about the situation? You said, we, that, you know... Yeah, we have been uh, advocating seriously about this issue. Uh, the most uh, uh, annoying thing and the most serious thing is they don't read. You know, if I say they don't read, Cocoa Board and then the Gov Ghana government don't read. Series of letters and other things has been there. Mm. Publications on this newspaper has been there. Uh, Cocoa Farmers want Hackman and others sacked. Mm. You know, uh, there are so many stories which is concerning about this kind of bad attitude of this uh, uh, Ghana government and then what is uh, uh, what they are doing uh, to help the Cocoa Farmers. We are saying this thing, thinking that the government will come to... To, to us and say, oh, fine, let us hold on the cocoa, uh, the, the distraction of the mm -hmm. cocoa, and then uh, let them, the, the farmers plant. When you go to Western region, as I'm speaking to you, Ghana don't have any cocoa. And we, the con concerned farmers, are giving warning to the presidency and the government. If they dare touch this cocoa tree, there will be no single cocoa tree in this country. Now, the Ochehene, he has said that um, the future of Ghana is, uh, the future of the Eastern region is not necessarily mining, yeah. but farming. What do you make of it? And now this is happening. What do you think about it? And do you believe in him and do you believe in what he said? Mm. I don't believe in what Ochehene said. Mm. I don't believe that. Why don't you? It is doorstep that all this illegal thing is happening. What have they done? He's an environmental. This is hard for Ghanaians to speak or to talk about. But we the concerned families, we, nobody owns us. We mm. are the we mm. are the next mm. generation, and this is our generation that we need to protect the generation. Right. They, their generation is past. So so if um the, 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 the farm is taking away, what, what's what's the next step? What are you hoping to do if, if your concerns are not heeded to? Well, we are telling the international communities that uh, they have to put a stop aid for Ghana have to put a stop. They don't have to buy Ghana cocoa and then any money that is coming from the international to the cocoa board or to Ghana, they have to put a stop to it because when the money even comes, it doesn't reflect in the lives of the cocoa farmers. Mm -hmm. And at the same time, if it comes in general for Ghanaians, as citizens, we don't feel it. So the international community have to put a stop to it. As I'm speaking to you, we have this internet, Al Jazeera and other uh, stations that they are going to that place with the BBC. We are mm. speaking to them so that they will go to the farm and then see themselves. Because what is on paper 
It's not what is on the ground. It's full of lies. Anything concerning a Greek in this country is fraud. Wow. Yes. Um, Isaac, um, I don't know if you can't try to buy a far or papa land. I don't know if you can't buy a man. I don't know if you can't buy a man. I don't know if you can't buy a man. I don't know if you can't buy a man. I don't know if you can't buy a man. I don't know if you can't buy a man. I don't know if you can't buy a Mm. Nti anya hwe kura no e yade e hye Ghana e no nyam. Na kokoa yade e ji sadin ye kwa kotu abui. Enfa so be na Ghana e be nya. Mm. Na ye nkirima no so a e ba no so. Omo ba asembe no be ka e de a chempe nimfo. Mm. Nti me de de me pese me sere na me ka ne se. Se ne mi nue ka en. E ye kokoa ye tugu na ye dua ne ma foforo ne de. Enke me sra ban. And in pen for all my own say. Oh, me, I say. Nanky, ye, ye. Now, and yef, say, ye better say, global president, the cocoa, would be a two cocoon at twigu. I did a ye galam say, and I say, dear mining, emma. Now, emma gana so ye yen winyam. Oh, ye cocoa say. Okay. Me da se eja. Isaac do se is son of Abraham. He do se who is the national best farmer for 2013, and he is just pleading that his father's land not be taken away from him. And he's saying his father has put in so much work in there, and also he's used it to take care of so many people, and so it would not be right for the land to be taken away from him. We also were was joined by Nano Boadia Boating the second, who is president of the Concerned Farmers. Association of Ghana, uh, and this is in relation to a 50 acre cocoa farm owned by the 2013 National Best Farmer being given out to small scale mining company.